Hi guys, um, happy Valentine's Day to whoever celebrates it. Um, today, I am kind of down in the blue right now because uh, school has not been going too well for me this week. I've got midterms and lab reports and whatnot, so I do have some good news that is blue. Um, today, like the title says, I have the uh, Nintendo 3DS and this is the Fire Emblem Awakening Edition. And to my knowledge, there's no video on YouTube that has an unboxing of this other than IGN. So, this is kind of exciting. Uh, this is the box it came in. It also came with this uh, album artwork kind of brochure thing. Um, it's very nice. It has this kind of glossy texture. Um, on the front, it's actually textured for... I believe this is Marth, don't quote me on this, but I know that Marth is a downloadable content player for Fire Emblem Awakening, and this is Chrome. Um, so yeah, there's a nice texture on that. Um, so I guess I'll flip through this before I get to the actual unboxing, so this gives kind of the Fire Emblem Awakening background story. There's Krom. Oh, so that is Marth. Okay, cool. Um, I know that in the Japanese version, Roy is a downloadable content player, um, but I'm not sure about the American version. So that's pretty cool. I've seen this guy in some of the trailers. Uh, Vike. Kind of a cool cinematic kind of scene. So yeah, this is some nice artwork. And that's that. So that's the artwork um, booklet that came with this pre-order. And here's the actual unit. So here's the front of the 3DS box. You've got the kind of standard Fire Emblem Awakening uh, image with Chrome kind of in attack position on the side. Not much on the back. It's got, again, kind of like some background information about the 3DS and the new Fire Emblem game. There's some photos of it. The bottom's all the like warranty, warning stuff, blah blah blah. And the side, not much. Just the standard Nintendo 3DS stuff. Okay, so getting this unboxed. This is my first 3DS, so kind of excited to see what's in it. I know there's plenty of unboxings for regular 3DS units um, on YouTube. So let's see what comes in here. So right off the bat, there's this huge pile of instruction manual stuff. So let's take a look at this really quick. You have the AR codes, which the 3DS is known for. So you can basically put this on a table and then you can use your 3DS camera and it'll make some animation come to life. And that's pretty cool. Here's my Club Nintendo registration card, 3DS quick start guide in different languages. And here's the operations manual in different languages as well. I will probably read through some of this because I don't know all of the settings of the 3DS. Again, this is the first time I've actually looked at the 3DS in my own hands, other than at Target and retail stores like that. Here's the charger. I believe this is a different charger from the 3DS, or from, I'm sorry, from the DSi, so this will not fit. I actually have my DSi right here. I guess it will fit. Maybe Nintendo finally made things backwards compatible. I have like five different chargers for all of my portable Nintendo consoles. So, yep. Standard stuff. Here's the 3DS. 
and nothing else interesting maybe there's more stuff on the bottom that feels heavier down here so let's ch quickly check that I could have sworn that 3DS came with a charging cradle well, it looks like that's it it's just cardboard well alrighty then no charging cradle so here's the 3DS so this is the turquoise kind of blue color not sure how well the camera picks this up but it is kind of a turquoise blue and here's the front so it's kind of a gradient there's a darker blue down here and then lighter blue up here it's hard to see from this lighting but on the front you have the Fire Emblem Awakening sword in the middle with two dragons next to it. It's pretty cool. Here's your wireless switch, your 3D slider. On the back we have the left and right uh, trigger buttons. Very quiet, not very clicky. Um, here's your charging port. Here's for Wi-Fi. Some sort of antenna. Here's the stylus, which is kind of hard to take out. And it is extendable. This is the 3DS card slot. And so regular three regular DS games will fit in here. This is the Fire Emblem Shadow Dragon. Okay, so that's the front. That's mainly the, the big thing that's different about this 3DS from other 3DSs is this Fire Emblem design on the front. So let's get this open. And there you go. There's the Fire Emblem 3DS edition. Got the standard power home start select. BXY D-pad uh, slider. I don't know what Nintendo calls this. Analog slider. Here's the 3D screen, so you can turn 3D off or on on Max. You've got the 3D cameras on the front here, and yeah, pretty nice unit. It feels pretty solid. Um, here's a. DSi for comparison of size. So the 3DS is a little bit thicker. And in terms of length and width, I think the DSi is a little bit bigger. Yeah, it's a little bit uh, wider than the 3DS. So, yeah. That's the limited edition Fire Emblem 3DS. Um, actually, where's the game? <laughs> uh, I think we have a problem. I don't have a game. There's nothing in this box. There's the guides here. Here's the AR cards. Here's the manual. There's no game. It says, oh, it's pre-installed. My bad. I thought there's an actual cartridge. It says game included, pre-installed. My bad. Sorry about that, guys. There's no actual Fire Emblem cartridge. That's why. So I guess it's already pre-installed on this. Well, that's that. <laughs> Alrighty. Um, as a quick update for my channel, I will be doing a review for the AKG K701 headphones soon. Um, I might also do some side video for jailbreaking your iPod Touch or iPhone. Um, this is my iPhone 4S running uh, the new iOS 6.1.1. And this is jailbroken, as you can tell by the different icons and the way they're arranged. Um, it's got Cydia and SB settings installed. So I might do 
a video about how to jailbreak that and what kind of jailbreak tweaks and apps I have. And actually tomorrow JDS Labs who made the Objective 2 and ODAC that I got um, in my previous unboxing video, they will be releasing their new portable amplifier called the C5 and I will probably be pre-ordering that tomorrow um, for their official press release. So if I do order that I will probably get it in the red color if that option is available. They're kind of tweaking with the different colors that they have. They have I think five different shades of black so they're working with the colors and anodize process so stay tuned for that. Um, but other than that that was my unboxing of the Fire Emblem Awakening edition of the 3DS. Thank you for watching, and if you have any comments or questions, please feel free to leave a comment below. Alright, signing out.